controversial action by authorities in Madhya Pradesh after those clashes were joined by uh, Anuma Acharya, spokesperson for the Congress and PKD in Ambiyar, a BJP supporter. State. Right, so there are two issues here. One is, of course, what happened on Ram Navmi on Sunday when there was, uh, you know, the, the processions taken out and then uh, uh, allegations of stone pelting and then clashes taking place. But PKD in Ambiya, what happened after that? The ma- Sunday you had the violence. On Monday, the authorities start demolishing uh, uh, properties of the accused. How can it happen so fast? There has to be some sort of process, some sort of rule of law, some sort of, you know, uh, avenue for people to at least... Uh, if they receive a notice to at least react to it before their houses are destroyed? Uh, Gargi, it is very unfortunate that uh, we have very less words, whether it is in the, some of the media or even in the, the spokesperson of the Congress and etc., to condemn the, uh, the, the uncivilized acts of uh, some section of the people attacking the Ram Navami. And we have very, very few words. And whereas, including the SP, and uh, many people have been attacked, shot, uh, they have used almost every kind of weapon. The, the discussion is too less on that. The discussion is too less on that. And we are only talking about an action the government or the authorities have taken against those people. Well, PKD Ambiya, that was that is, clashes and riots. And yes, of course, that too has to be investigated. And it's very unfortunate on a day when you're celebrating, uh, you know, Lord Ram, you have this kind of violence taking place and, uh, you know, and the stone pelting, etc. And of, of course, that has to be investigated. But for the moment, uh, we are, we're talking about this issue of, you know, dem- demolishing uh, properties of those accused just within... Why? 24 hours uh, there you know and it's it, and you, and it has been seen that's very one sided let's not uh, forget the fact that it's uh, one particular community that is seeing this kind of action and as uh, anuma acharya pointed out even a house that was built under the pm uh, yojana has been demolished on and saying that it's illegal how can this be uh, gargi you are uh, either not being informed very well generally you are a person who understands everything in a complete perspective at least may don't get into the trap of the Congress narrative. The, uh, the, the houses which were demolished is an unauthorized construction. There was already a notice being served to them earlier. Now, the, the, now coming to the first part of it, I think the most important part of a discussion should be, the discourse should be, a section of the society. I don't call them Muslims. I don't call them Hindus. I call them the Danga Karnevala, the, the brutal uh, 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 anti-social elements. And if any action taken on them should be uploaded rather than supporting them for any reason. So the first and foremost thing is that people who are uh, creating com- uh, 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 communal disharmony in the society, the people who are taking the law in their hand and attacking the police and the people, even a policeman who was attacked, does he have not have, uh, have a family? The people who are even attacked, they don't have a family. He, the people who take Congress and some section of the media he is only and only talking about who oh, they are Muslims. Why we are we talking about Muslim and Hindu here? The people who are the culprit should be treated as an anti-social element, whether which, whichever religion they are from. But here there is a, some kind of a minority appo- appeasement is again coming uh, taking place. This is the reason this country has not been able to progress. No, it's hardly in the last appeasement, years. you know. And and yes, uh, we we are talking further, That's but uh, quickly, PK in Ambia, your reaction to that? I think it's very very unfortunate. I think I don't know which uh, century we are living in. This Congress spokesperson is living in. Uh, I I think uh, they don't even understand the difference between uh, 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 the people who are. Uh, Creating a communal uh, harmony and the people who what is happening in Madhya Pradesh. Is, and I what what are you about, talking about? First and foremost, the, is this government is not even four year old. The government uh, uh, in, in Madhya Pradesh, the first one year was uh, the Kamal Nath was the the, the, the the chief minister. What are you talking about? You you also look at it. Rahul Gandhi's statement last week, what he was talking about. If a Dalit, uh, he should have been uh, picked up a uh, uh, knife for a gun and go and uh, kill the other person. I think you are also Please using the same threat from I think there. it is an inherited word from the, 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 the complete context of it. On the, your hypocrisy is to the level today as true to this level. On the one side, rather than criticizing the, the, the people who have done such kind of an act, you are not ready to criticize. You wanted to say that there, you only wanted to focus on the demolition. If there is Congress has got so much of an issue, why don't you go to the court and say that, yes, this demolition is wrong. Let the government rebuild the house. That definitely no will be done. Why that, that, that should that be done. That will be done.
But at the same yeah, time, the government have, has taken law and order in their own hands that talks about absolute failure of administration in Bangladesh. I, I, I think I, right, I think we we'll just have to leave it there, but we'll I, continue, I, you know, I, to I raise this issue and.